Hey everyone, I'm Andrew Galata, producer for Battlefield 1 at our DICE studio right here in LA. I'm standing inside the Creator Cave at EA Play where your art community is creating new content to share with players across the globe. It's unbelievably rewarding to see more than 20 million players embracing the game, crafting their own memorable moments, only possible in Battlefield 1. Let's take a look. Hey, Noob, I got, I got some questions to ask you. Okay. What is it about the Battlefield franchise that's so special and appealing to you? The thing I find special about Battlefield is teamwork. I'm not good at shooting. Sometimes I like to repair or heal or hide. I'm most definitely proud to be a part of the Battlefield community. I've never been a part of any other gaming community where people are just so passionate about their game. Everyone in this community is focusing on making this game as best as it can be and expanding on the experiences that we've already had. <laughs> Was mich an Battlefield begeistert, ist die schiere Bandbreite an Dingen, die ich in diesem Spiel tun kann. Player versus tank versus plane versus environment. My most memorable moments is what I do with my community. A 64-man army that just does massive, crazy things. I have made so many amazing friends who have become more like family. It's something that brought a whole lot of people together. Who will squad up and go and tear it up. Boom! You got it? Oh, I killed them all! I killed them all! Kill. I'll never be able to do that again in my life. I'll never be able to do that again in my life. Never ever. That's it. That's as good as it gets. I should just stop playing. I should quit. <laughs> he just disabled a moving truck with a grenade while jumping off a horse. <laughs> Incredible. We love these only in Battlefield moments, and we want even more of them. So we're bringing more ways for you to play. First, Night Maps debut this summer. In Neville Knights and Prise de Teher, you'll need to deploy tactics as you fight through the night in a massive network of trenches. Second, I'm excited to announce a major revolution in Battlefield 1. We're bringing epic battles to the Eastern Front of World War I. In the Name of the Tsar expands Battlefield 1 to the blistering winter in the East. This is the biggest front of World War I. And with it, we're bringing you six new maps, the Russian army, including the mighty Hussar cavalry, new vehicles and weapons to expand your arsenal, and the iconic Women's Battalion of Death. Finally, we're introducing a richer gameplay experience in both progression and operations mode. By bringing deeper player progression through all new assignments, the ability to tailor your playstyle with specializations, and new multi-battle experiences woven through the fan-favorite game mode operations. All of this coming in September as part of In the Name of the Tsar. And for the next three days, the Lupkow Pass map from In the Name of the Tsar is right here at EA Play. For those of you tuning in, you'll get a glimpse of it from these guys when they share it on their channels very soon. So there you have it, eight new maps in total, opening up the largest front in World War I with new ways to play. There's never been a better time to be part of the Battlefield community. Now enough of me. Let's give you a first look at In the Name of the Tsar. A revolution is coming. Услышишь гром и вспомнишь обо мне. Полоска неба будет твердо алой. А сердце будет, как тогда. 